Good morning. This is Chispa right here. We're gonna be doing some slow pitch jigging today. You don't wanna miss out. We're on the south side of Puerto Rico and we're ready. Let's go. So I'm gonna do some unit, the unit uh, not here in the gray to uh, fluorocarbon. I'm using a 40 pound fluorocarbon leader, a 30 pound uh, braided line, and then we're using a 6'6 um, go fishing uh, slow pitch jigging that I'm trying for the first time. So let's see how it goes. Okay, so we're here. Uh, we're gonna do some uh, slow pitch jigging, you know, with a little bit of fast jigging too. We're gonna do both. Uh, but right now we're using uh, Johnny Gigs, 150 gram. There's a little screen on the bottom. Uh, I'm using a 30 pound uh, rated line and 40 pound fluorocarbon leader, okay? Let's see how it goes. We're hooked up, let's see what it is. I was reeling it in because I was slowing the bottom, but we have a lot of current. We're basically drifting, we're not staying on one spot. Um, usually for slow pitch jig, and you, obviously you want to be straight up, you know? Um, but uh, right now, today, we don't have the good conditions, so we're just drifting and working with what we can. So, basically, I was working the bottom and then start reading faster, like a fast jigging action. We got hooked up. Definitely not a tootie because we don't have wire on this jig, so. Oh, it looks like a black fin tuna. We got the first black fin of the day. There you go, the same jig that I just showed you guys right there. Nice black fin to start the morning. We're on. Nice fish. So we've been like trying a little bit with the slow fish, you know, it's our first time doing slow fish jigging. Um, you know, I'm not an expert by any means. I'm just trying to do what I think it will work. Um, right now we have a lot of wind. I know that with slow pitch you gotta be vertical you know and keep the boat in reverse and all that but we're just drifting and working on the bottom you know and it's working we're catching fish I'm loving this rod you know like I'm not used to conventional rods or vertical G and I'm always using spinning rods but this is fun the mighty 6'6 six, six. from Google Fishing and then I'm using a Forge 8 Tsunami Reel
they give you off. So it's a black jug. This is the fish I wanted to catch today with this rod because they fight pretty good. So I wanted to test this, test the rod. So that's The 150 gram jig, squid working good. Already caught two black fin tuna and a black jack. Back to the deep. Thank you, bud. All right, so I was dropping the jig and they took it going down. As I was free spooling the line, you know, I'm new with this reel. So I was trying to put the drag up and I couldn't. Ooh, it's a nice fish. It looks like a tuna for sure. Definitely a blackfin or a yellowfin. I think it's a blackfin. Yeah, it's a tuna because it's coming up. Yeah. I'm not used to this small setup, but they're super fun. Esos son Blackfin. No le metan mucho freno a eso. So since we, since we got a lot of wind, we can't be vertical, like I said. So basically what I'm doing and it's you know it's working I'm not saying it's the right way to do it but over here with the condition that we have this is the way that we're doing it basically I just get it away from the bottom like a little bit you know a couple times without reeling and then after a couple of times if I don't get a bite then all I do is I put it right over here and I start jerking a little bit more. And I've got all my fish doing this. I haven't done anything different. We're gonna film another video later with better conditions, more for slow pitch vertical jigging. But for today, we're doing what we can with what we have. And we wanted to fish with the new rods. All right, so this jig has been in the water like, I don't know, three, three, three times maybe. Look at that. All right, we're using uh, this jig. It's 150 gram to work the bottom. Hopefully we can get a grouper or something. So we'll see. We are trying to work the bottom with this current. I think this is exactly what we were looking for. Um, I'm almost sure that it's a strawberry grouper. So we'll see. He's on too. I can see the line is starting to go up. So he's starting to float. So that means that it could be a, a strawberry grouper. Oh yeah, and there it is. Look at that. That's a nice one. Holy cow. Look 
Look at that one. Nice size strawberry grouper right there. On the 150 gram jig. First try. That's so cool. Such a good eating. And this guy is still hooked up there. All right, that's what we wanted to catch. So hopefully we can get a couple more. Keep in tune, guys. Edgar Blackjack. The Blackjack guy. So basically what I'm doing now with this jig is I'm probably reading like a couple times on the bottom, you know? And then I let it sink again. Like that. Might be a rainbow runner. We'll see. Feels, feels like it. I was just reeling and reeling fast all the way up because since we got so much current today, you know I can work the bottom for a couple times and then I gotta bring bring it in. I don't know about that run. It was really weird. Oh, Big King. Una sierra, bichero. Nice smoker. Nice one. Right on the bottom. That's a nice fish right there. Feels like a grouper, but if it's a grouper, it's a nice one. Ah. Woo! This is a nice fish, you guys. So he haven't taken any big runs. So I will assume it's a grouper catching a lot of uh, blackjacks, you know, um, and they take a lot of runs. They're pretty strong fish, but this fish is like a dead weight. I'm, start I'm starting to think that it could be a yellowtail grouper, and I don't want to think of that because that's one of my dream fish. You know, we don't get a lot of them here. So if it's a yellowtail grouper, oh my God, I'm going to be so stoked. You know, anything we get out here, I'm stoked, but Obviously, we got our species in our mind that we want to catch, so. Let's see. It's starting to feel like a dead weight. It could be a big grouper. We'll see. If not, it doesn't matter. It's a nice fight. Maybe a black jug, I don't know. Oh my god, yellowtail grouper! Yellowtail grouper! Bro, we don't. Yellowtail grouper. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is the dream. Oh my god. This is one of my dream fish right here. I've never seen one. Bro. Oh my god, bro. Look at that, bro. Oh. Look at that beauty. Abre el pool en el tuyo. Wow. Right there on the 100 on 50 gram jig. Wow. Beautiful fish right here, guys.
guys, so we're here. Um, this is the fishing that we did today. The weather was really rough out there. There was a lot of wind, a lot of currents. It wasn't a good day for jigging or slow pitch jigging. Um, but this is what we caught today. Um, one of my dream fish that I've been hunting for a long time right here, the yellow tail grouper. I know it could be a, maybe a not so rare fish in some places in the world, but over here we don't get them often. So that's my first uh, nice yellow tail grouper, yellow, uh, yellow, yellow fin grouper. And then we got two black fin, rain, uh, rainbow runner, three strawberry grouper, and this nice king. Guys, if you like this video, please share it, subscribe, hit that uh, notification button, and thanks for watching.